Hello, Pisces. This is Queen Omen Rock coming to you with your general reading. Let's get into it, Pisces. Let's see what's in your cards. Happy full moon. Happy full moon to my Pisces. All right, let's go. Let's see what's in your cards, Pisces. Let's go. Let's see what's in your cards. Talking to you every Pisces is in your birth chart. This is a general reading, so take only what resonates with you. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. All right, Pisces. Somebody's getting back to some hard work and creating, creating, creating. I love it. Leaving the past behind. All right, so here we have the Knight of Pentacles here. So getting back to some hard work. Here we have the Ace of Cups here. So some new compassion and creativity is coming across your path. You're leaving the past behind, um, which is good. Past belief systems behind about certain things. Here we have the um, Nine of Pentacles here. So somebody feels very much included, you know, in something as you're moving on to like financial independence. And I do see some money coming across your path. So congratulations there. Um, here we have the five of wands. Something could feel like a bait and switch, you know, for you, you know, coming across your path. But it's really not. It really is not a bait and switch, you know, um, if you pray ahead of time. You know, just like, um, like I said, you've been working really, really hard and, um, you know, for your, on your, your financial independence and your very creative energy and something is almost going to feel like, okay, is this for real? Like, is this real? So whatever it is you've been working on trying to create, it is very real. It is, it's very, very real. So you've been trying to create something new. And it's working. You're going to start receiving money for it. And um, it's, it's going towards your legacy. So congratulations. Here we have the Six of Wands here. So 5 and 6 is 11. So Source is saying get off the fence. Like get off the fence. Stop overthinking something. Like, you know, it's something that you've been thinking about doing. You know, so something that you've been, you've been like you've been talking about enlightening people. Right? It's something you've been talking about doing. It's time to do it. You'd be surprised at how like... <laughs> How, you know, creatives, like think of ideas, Pisces, and you'll be thinking like, hmm, you sit down and think about, so, okay, should you write a book? Should you write a screenplay? Should you think of like the latest post-it notes? <laughs> should you come up with the latest, uh, you know, like look like that, that flower right there on this table? Or should you come up with the latest slogan or... Like these little clips right here. Like who thought of this idea? Like you always come up with all these creative ideas. You just never know like really what's going to take off. So <clears throat> that's where somebody's mind is in like this just this creative space, right? And so whatever it is, you're going to start getting money for it. And um, it's, it's, you know, leading you in that financial independence. And you've been working hard on something. So that's, that's something that's taking flight. Something is really, really taking flight. Here we have the Eight of Swords here. And um, and so, so it's just saying, now you're going to start looking in the mirror and you're going to start seeing yourself doing that, whatever that is. You know, you're not going to see yourself as not being able to do that. That's the mirror work. That's the positive side to it. It's like, okay, you're going to see yourself actually doing it. You're not going to see yourself as feeling restricted, whatever that is. Remember, this is a general reading, right? <clears throat> so take only what resonates with you, but you're going to get off the fence of just being indecisive. That's the when we had 11-11 Pisces, you're going to get off the fence of saying, mm, I kind of am a little familiar with, um, but I think I can. Then you're going to go right into, I can do this. I, I can do it. So whatever it is, maybe you're making the latest sneakers. I mean, whatever it is, right? I mean, this is a general reading, so... Whatever it is, you won't feel restricted. You won't feel restricted. You just want to just like, the ideas are just going to start flowing, right? Here's the devil card. You won't be chained to fear. You won't be chained to doubt, uncertainty. All of that's going to, you're going to start believing in yourself. That's what the um, moon card is. You're going to start believing in yourself. You won't be chained to other people's fear, their doubt, because you've already detached from something. You've already detached from something. So you won't you won't even it won't even, you know. Yeah, it, it just it, it won't even <laughs> it won't even come across like a second, 
yeah, yeah you, you just, yeah. So it'll be a breakthrough. It's a breakthrough for you. <clears throat> you won't even, something about, that's, it won't even feel like, you'll start going back through your mind of just how, like, when you were connected to certain energies that were just, like, naysayer spirits, Pisces. And it'll just kind of like, as soon as it comes out of your mouth, it's like, okay, you know, source, put it in your spirit. You'll kind of have this, like, I can do it spirit. And you'll get around other kind of energies like that. That feel like, okay, this person, they, they like a crazy dreamer, but they'll put energy behind it. You won't feel restricted. Here's a judgment card because you're above the judgment. You're above other people's judgment. You're not judging other people when they have ideas, but you're not, you're like, you're trying to break generational cycles, chains, and curses, so you're just in that creative space. Here we have the five of pentacles here, and it's like you just went in the lab, like you just went in like, like five and six, you got five and six, you know your worth, you know your value, you're just keeping people out your, you keeping people out of your vault door, you like, your brain is just like ticking, <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm looking at here in the car like you working hard your brain is ticking you working on something and so you're like mm -mm. You, you don't have time to talk you somebody just don't have time you don't you don't have time for the judgment you don't have time for uh, what if this doesn't work and what if that doesn't work and what if such a such somebody's just in a you just in a different you're in creative mode so that's where that's the frequency that you're on Pisces so good for you good for you here's a strength card here Yep. <clears throat> so you've learned how to heal yourself. You learn how somebody learned how to heal themselves behind a closed door. So that's nice, right? Here's a magician card. So you initiated something. You initiated investing in yourself. I love it. All right. So let's see what else we got. Let's see what else we got in your cards. All right. All right. All right. All right. So yeah, the judgment card is really um, Pluto. That's the um, <clears throat> that's the outermost planet. You've gone through a metamorphosis. Somebody has really gone through a metamorphosis behind closed doors. And you've gone through a very powerful transformation, death, rebirth. So, yeah, here's a six of swords here. So, yeah. <clears throat> here's a chariot card. So, yeah, so you hashtag winning behind closed doors. Well, Source is actually rewarding you, right? So here we have the Four of Cups. Mm -hmm. Somebody may have lamented over something because we have the Ace of Cups or whatever. You may have lamented over something maybe behind closed doors, but you may have even lamented to people. Who knows? But um, you became stronger is what I'm seeing. You became stronger. And Source actually rewarded you for taking the high road. That's what this is about. Source has actually rewarded you for taking the high road. Like you climbed your way up from like a pit, like a dark place. This right here, see how this person is climbing up? You took your swords back, your power, your intellect. <coughs> right? Here we had the, this uh, Knight of Swords and you stayed focused. Yeah, you stayed focused. That's how somebody fought back. That's how you fought back from lamenting. That's this right here. See? Yeah, that's how somebody fought back. So, the two situations made somebody really sad. Two situations in particular made somebody really, really sad. So, <clears throat> so yeah, you, you're not, you're not, this is a five of wands here. Yeah, you're, you're, you're in a different, you're in a different frequency. You're just on a totally different frequency, right? Yeah, there you are. Here we have the um, King of Swords here. Totally different frequency at this point. Yep. Here we have the Page of Swords here. So, whatever anxiety you may have been having, it'll be going away very soon. Whatever anxiety you may have been having, it'll be going away soon. A lot of people taking notes. A lot of people like, okay, this person, they came out. They came out. Um, hold on. I think we already had these cards. Hold on. Let me get the other cards um wait a minute let me get the other cards <clears throat> yeah yeah you came out you're not playing games you, you're not playing games i mean that's like somebody said you just stopped talking somebody just shut down somebody just stopped talking you just came out you just came out like you ain't playing games <laughs> it's not 
I don't know who I'm talking You know, uh, yeah, I'm not laughing at anybody, okay? Don't take that the wrong way. I'm, t I'm laughing with you. I'm like, okay, like cheering you on for real. Like somebody went... I would I somebody literally went in the vault. Like you like somebody went into the vault of their mind and said, You coming out gladiator. <laughs> That's what I'm just looking at your cards here. Like somebody said. And I'm talking about like in terms of just like power. Like this this is King of Swords here. Like a person who came out like you don't have anything negative to say about anybody. You all is forgiven, <laughs> but you came out like the way you coming out is like people taking notes, like what in the world? Right, so here we had the um, higher palm card here. So, some kind of dark, um, some kind of, um, you know, like dark energies was taking note. Like, what in what was going on behind closed doors? Here we had the six of swords here. What was going on behind closed doors? So here we have the nine of pentacles here, right? So a lot of people are just saying a whole lot of stuff, a lot of shady stuff, but it don't matter. Like, it don't really matter. A lot of people are saying a lot of shady stuff, a lot of stuff was going through the air. People were saying somebody was drinking and whatever, but that wasn't, I don't know if that was, I don't know what was the case. Here we had the eight of, I mean, the three of cups here. That was a lot of talking going on. But what actually what was going on, looking at your cards here, look what was going on with that. <clears throat> somebody was, um, somebody had, um, went to like the eight of cups. Eight of cups is like a person, like, it's like you woke up one night and went to the next level. Like you said, if you want your wishes to be fulfilled, you're going to have to go to like nine would be the death rebirth. Right, so you're going to have to end investing in like, um, like caring about people devaluing you, like if that makes any sense to somebody, like somebody had to stop caring, like what people thought about them. That's what it really, that's what it really brought, this right here, thinking, somebody had to stop caring about what negative stuff people were saying about them. That's what it, can, that's what it really boiled down to, because that was making somebody depressed. The dark stuff people were saying about you, you had to stop caring. You had to say, okay, if people thought this, whatever, let them think whatever. That was the frequency you had to get to. So, there it is. New beginnings. Ace of Pentacles. Well, all right now, Pisces. Congratulations to you. Congratulations. All right. Let's close it out. That's what somebody had to get to. You had to get to, like, getting delivered from other people's opinions of you. Their judgment. Somebody had to leave all of that behind. There is a song. I was just saying, well, there is a song that's, uh, I was trying to think of this song. I could see the video in my mind because it, it's a really funny song. It's this artist. And the video, if y'all remember like back in the day when they would have the, the videos to this, I don't know if they still have it or not, but they, it was like this really catchy, uh, I can't even remember the words to the song, but it was kind of speaking to your reading about how like people will make these judgments about people when they don't really know what's going on in people's lives. And in this case right here, you know, people were being really shady, like, oh, they must be drinking behind closed doors. They must be into this and must be doing all into that behind closed doors they must be into something satanic behind closed doors something must be dark all of this other stuff but really what it was looking at your cards here <clears throat> somebody was really just investing in themselves that's what it was so anyway they're planning to disrupt your money backfire but yeah so um um healer and protector of travelers is with you but your well of joy is within you um, so get some fresh air. Get some fresh air. Take a leap of faith. You have a new attitude, right? So heart shopper cleanse. Walk away. They apologize for hurting you. And let's see. Um, do, 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 do. Root chakra cleanse. So you're just doing a, like a deep cleanse at the root. Like root chakra cleanse. So close out the cycle on love. Spies now turned on. 
Yep, so that's what somebody was doing. Somebody was healing. So many different ways of healing, especially now, today, with like social media, technology, choose to listen to certain things, healing music, you know, um, getting some fresh air, listening to affirmations, all sorts of things. So don't let your past hold you back. There it is, South Node. So look up your South Node birth um, link for birth charts below. And then look up your north node. Find out what your south node and your north node is. But yeah. But anyway, divine love. When you offer everything to the divine with detachment, you begin a love affair with spirit. Mm-hmm. Yep. So. So, so, so. Let's see what else we got going on here. So stress. I release what I cannot control. I release tension in my body. I relax my jaw and I clench my teeth. I allow my shoulders to be heavy. I breathe in gratitude and exhale pressure. Stress is temporary. I welcome stress-free days into my life. I'm counting my blessings. Great things are happening to me. Yeah, great things are happening to me. Yeah, because they are. Great things are happening to you. So, All right. So I'm grateful for all the things that's unfolding in my life and all that is yet to come. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. <clears throat> uh, here's a number. Here's a number, here's a number, here's a number. 19, I'm a pioneer. So, independence and self-sufficiency are necessities to you. You are extremely capable in life and in work, and you aren't afraid to take big risks to achieve the life that you desire. 19, yep. Yeah achieve the life that you desire that's all it took pisces you all are um and i'm talking to you wherever pisces is in your birth chart it doesn't have to be just your sun sign so even for my crosswalk just check your birth chart all you had to do was start believing in yourself believing in your believing in your dreams right that's what i have for you i'll see you in the next video bye